this video i would like to tell about the a new method for flow based network intrusion detection using the inverse ports model now we are going to see about the overview of our process that is the abstract intrusion detection is one of the important security problems in today's cyber world a significant number of techniques have been developed which are based on machine learning approaches so far we have to identify the intrusion we have to design the different machine learning algorithms a intru network based intrusion detection system is usually placed as network points such as a gateway and routers to check for intrusions in the network traffic Uh, we have to identify the intrusion detection attacks in the network by using the uh, some different machine learning classifiers in our process we have to use the kdd cup ids dataset it was taken from dataset repository then we have to implement the some pre processing techniques for cleaning our input data then we have to implement the different machine learning classifiers algorithms uh, such as logistic regression k nearest neighbor and random forest for predicting or classifying the attacks that is intrusion detection in the network traffic then finally the result shows that some accuracy for above mentioned algorithms and we have to compare the algorithms results then finally we have to predict the uh, predict the attacks by using the above mentioned classification algorithms so this is the overview of our process now we are going to see about the flow of our process uh, this is the flow diagram for our process first we have to take your input data set our data set name is kdd cup ids data set which is taken from data set repository after that we have to uh, import your input data set then we have to implement the pre processing step in this step we have to remove the unwanted or unnecessary data or else we have to clean your input data set uh, in this step we have to perform some techniques the first we have to handle the missing values here we have to check the missing values uh, is uh, here we have to check the any missing values is present in your input data set if we if any missing values is present in your input data we have to replace the missing values by zeros or some uh, mean values after that we have to perform the label encoding in this step we have to encode the data into some labels that is we have to uh, convert the string into some binary numeric integer values after that we have to perform drop unwanted columns here we have to drop any un, uh, we have to drop the any unnecessary or unwanted columns because it is not required in your process uh, then the next module is we have to split your data that is data splitting here we have to split your uh, input data into test and train in testing part we test data is used for predicting your model then train data is used for evaluate your model then we have to implement the classification algorithm uh, here we have to uh, use some machine learning algorithms like k nearest neighbor logistic regression and random forest after that we have to predict the uh, objective that is here we have to predict the uh, intrusion attacks or non attacks in uh, network traffic then we have to find the performance analysis here we have to uh, analyze some performance metrics like accuracy precision recall and f1 score so this is the flow of our process now we are going to see about the demo part so this is our output part we are running our process in spider ide from anaconda navigator 
first module this is the data selection so this is the sample input data from our data set then we have to checking missing values here the zero means there is a no missing values in particular attribute here all attribute contains the zero so zero means number of missing values count so here there is no missing values so in our data set we have not no missing data so just we have to move on the next step we have to perform label encoding here label encoding before label encoding so these are the we have to label in uh, encode the label the attribute is label attribute so here contains the normal after label encoding they contains the integer values then we have to apply the min max normalization for optimizing our data set so before applying your min max normalization here after applying the min max normalization then we have to uh, splitting your whole input data set into testing and training so your whole input data set rows so after splitting your data set the training data contains uh, these number of rows and testing data contains the these number of rows after that we have to implement the classification algorithm here random forest contain the uh, result 99 percent so this is the result for random forest then we have to similarly the result for logistic regression contains 99.76 then similarly uh, this is the result for k nearest neighbor so the k nearest neighbor results contains 99.86 percentage so these are the algorithms which we are implemented then we have to uh, predict the attack or non attack by using the classification algorithm i have to display some uh, input data and the result for uh, 10 number of uh, data as a result so these are the our output for our uh, intrusion detection process thank you